Hi everyone, this is Kang with a different set of gadgets and gizmos brought to you by ASRock. We will be discussing more and more ASRock products as we go along and I'll be giving you insights about what to expect from their product lineup along with a short overview of what it has to offer. So today we are greeted with Intel's latest rendition when it comes to the Z series motherboard lineup from ASRock. We have here the ASRock Z590 Taichi. Taichi being one of their flagship models when it comes to their Rocket Lake processor that was introduced with premium features. So what are we waiting for? Let's go and unbox this. <laughs> So, as you can see here at the top, you will see two separate box. And the top part consists of the motherboard itself, but we don't want to look at it yet. We're going to save it for later. <laughs> okay, so we have here the motherboard. Let's set that, as that aside. And we have here, of course, the accessories. Okay. Ta-da! We have here the driver, some card, Tai Chi card, manual, quick installation guide, and the stickers. And it's matte. On the other side, we have here, this one's for the Wi-Fi. We have here some brackets, some Velcro, Astrof Velcro thingy. A small fan. This is so cute. This is for the Wi-Fi, yeah. Some M.2 screws, additional screws, brackets. We have a keychain. It's a motherboard keychain. It's so cute. And SATA cables, of course. And that's for the second box. Let's set this aside now and Let's see this beautiful ASRock C590 Tai Chi. Okay, wow. This is amazing. In terms of aesthetics, the ASRock Z590 Tai Chi has a dominantly black and sleek design, with armor covering the majority of the PCIe slot area with ASRock's patent-pending graphics holder included in the packaging. The usual cogwheel-inspired design appears on the chipset heatsink, and another cogwheel is added to the rear panel cover, both of which has RGB LED lighting with a polychrome RGB sync. The second cogwheel is a mechanical moving part and it's the first moving part integrated in a motherboard. This motherboard sports 10th gen Intel Core processors as well as the 11th gen Intel Core processors, thanks to its LGA1200 socket, providing key features like advanced I.O. features and full support for the PCIe Gen 4.0. The ASRock Tai Chi has two full-length PCIe 4.0 slots with a third slot reinforced with ASRock Steel slot and PCIe armor on the M.2 heatsink. A few things to keep in mind are that if the second slot is being used, it would disable SATA 0 and SATA 1 slots. And the case is the same if the third PCIe M.2 slot is used, SATA 4, SATA 5, and PCIe 4 slots will be disabled. To keep things cooled out, ASRock implemented a small fan into the CPU section. Beside the CPU socket are the four DDR4 RAM slots that support up to 128GB and up to 500MHz frequency. For the onboard audio, the ASRock Z590 Tai Chi has a Realtek ALC1220 HD audio codec with ESS Sabre 9218DAC. For the HD audio codec, there are three Japanese gold Nichicon audio capacitors. On the rear panel, the motherboard sports all the necessary ports, which include dual Thunderbolt 4, 2 USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type A, and 4 USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type A ports. For the audio, there are five 3.5 audio jacks and an SPDIF optical output at the center of the panel. For video output, the integration of the HDMI 2.0 is available. And lastly, for networking, ASRock includes two LAN ports along with a killer AX1675X Wi-Fi 6E.
Well, that's my unboxing of this ASRock Tai Chi Z590 motherboard. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Again, this is Kang, and I hope to see you on my next video. Bye, everyone! <laughs>